The world's meeting of families this week is the 10th one in 28 years. It was St. John Paul II who launched the first world's meeting of families in 1994, largely as a response to the modern attacks on the family. At that time, the United Nations General Assembly had dubbed 1994 as the International Year of the Family, a year filled with events that promoted abortion and population control advocates. St. John Paul II understood the opportunity to correct and evangelize. The modern-day saint declared the end of 1993 a special year of the family for the church. In 1994, the Polish pontiff took a series of actions to highlight the beauty of the family. He issued a letter for families. He beatified the heroic doctor Gianna Beretta Mala, who gave her life in 1962 to ensure the safe birth of her daughter. John Paul II instructed the Pontifical Council for the Family, now a part of the dicastery for lady, family, and life. And that same year, the modern-day saint established what would be the inaugural World's Meeting of Families. The event took place in Rome. The 1994 World's Meeting of Families was so successful, it has since become a regular event in the life of the church, taking place approximately once every three years. Out of the 10 World's Meeting of Families so far, three were in Rome, including this year's. The other cities have included Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, Manila, Philippines, Valencia, Spain, Mexico City, Mexico, Milan, Italy, Philadelphia, USA, and Dublin, Ireland. Now, 28 years since the first World Meeting of Families, St. John Paul II's vision has become all the more important.